Austin. And Amanda, thank you. You know, today, Austin City Council will vote on a controversial proposal that aims to make your commute a bit easier. Yeah, the Capital Area Metropolitan Planning Organization, otherwise known as CAMPO, released its 2040 plan. It drew a lot of criticism, though, and concern from residents. City leaders not really sure what to do. They need to decide on whether to encourage the organization to drop its plans. Well, Kate Whitehall is live for us in South Austin near Mopac with your details on what is the holdup. Good morning. Good morning. Well, up above me over here is Mopac. And in this Campo 2040 plan, they're proposing to add four additional toll lanes on Mopac between Caesar Chavez and Slaughter, as well as a double decker bridge that would run over Lady Bird Lake. Now, today, City Council has a resolution in front of them sponsored by Mayor Pro Tem Kathy Tovo to encourage Campo to remove this from their plan and instead explore some alternatives. Now, those alternatives include adding one or two additional lanes or not building at all. There are two big reasons council members have heard that folks don't want this. One, it could cause harm to Zilker Park with the additional lanes. And two, the road would dump traffic out by Austin High School to get to Cesar Chavez and West 5th Streets. Now, right now, four city council members sit on Campos Policy Board, and Tovo feels council could have some influence on this long range plan. We hope that it will send a strong message if the city council asked Campo to, to do what they did with the 2035 plan. They did remove it from the 2035 plan, and really all we're asking is that they remove it from the 2040 plan, continue their studies, but remove it for now. And Campo's policy board will vote on this plan next week. Tovo says even if they remove it, they could always add it back in as an amendment later on. Of course, we'll keep it posted. We're live in South Austin. Kate Whitehall, KXAN News. Okay.